back to another fishing vlog. I haven't had much luck so far. And I've been out here for quite a bit now, but we have a, uh, a bunch of my aunts and uncles are coming over in a few days, so. Is that my line, like right here? Yeah, that is my line, so my line is stuck. Did I fix it? Oh, that's the problem. Okay. I think we're almost there to you guys. But yeah, so my, a bunch of my family, my aunt and uncles are coming over to my camp area for a fish dinner real soon, so we get, uh, around Friday or Saturday, maybe Sunday. So I gotta catch a bunch of fish. We're not looking for pike at all because we've already got like around eight of them. Mainly what we're looking for is bass. And that's why I came here. This is a great spot for bass. So, oh, also this camera setup is not my normal one because I forgot to bring my normal camera holding thing. However, my I'm gonna probably fish a bit after the camera dies because it's not at the best for battery. Like it's batteries around a uh, half percent or lower. Actually, I believe it's lower, quite a bit, quite, quite a bit lower. But, but perhaps we will have uh, something by the end of this video. Is the goal, hopefully. Hopefully, we have great luck, and I think I have a fish on right now, actually. And there's the first fish. There it is, guys. We got our first bass in. <sighs> Settle down, bro. First bass, guys, it's in. Not a big one, but not too small. We're gonna release him. What an asshole. He just splashed me in the face. What a dick. But yeah, so that's exactly what we're looking for right there, but a bit bigger. Not too much bigger, but a decent size bigger. So, that's what I'm talking about. Been out here the last four hours. And all I've caught one has been a sunfish. And it was a nice size sunfish, but also it, I I put a, a sunfish back and I mean I could keep a few sunfish because we don't exactly have too many of those, but the main thing what we're looking for has been bass and now we got the first bass in, which is great. But let's just get a bigger one because that's not exactly, I like it, it was a good size, I could have kept it, but not exactly what we're hoping for. We're looking for some big, big pieces, bass, like big bass, nice size, great for eating. So let's go closer to these, to this area where I know for a fact there are bass. And you know what, let's even drop in an anchor just to keep us in this area. I've already seen fish bubbles, a lot of them. So yeah, let's speed the head forward quite a bit. All right, this is good. Than I would have hoped, 
but it's not a horrible entrance, I guess. But yeah, five minutes in, we've already caught one fish. Let's get another one for this video, a bigger one. Not exactly where I would have wanted to actually cast it towards, but it'll do. I'm hearing bullfrogs, which could be a good sign, I guess. I don't know. I'm gonna stand up here. Seeing a few more fish bubbles or animal bubbles with animals underwater breathing. We need a bigger bass than the one that we just caught. Which wasn't exactly a small bass. It wasn't a horribly small bass. Like it could could have been a keeper, but we're looking for bass that are big. I just saw a big fish bubble right there, so I didn't exactly cast where it was, but it was a uh, decent speed, uh, a decent amount ahead of us. And there's a giant one just in front of me here, so. And whatever that, whatever fish had that bubble right there, it did just bite my line. Not my line, like my bait. Okay, what a crappy cast. If there's a fish right there, it's gone now. That cast was so horrible, it literally almost knocked off my entire bait. Alright, let's turn this boat around. So you guys can see exactly what I'm casting towards. And there the most likely will be a part two to, to this video. Alright, so there's exactly where I'm casting towards. You know what, let's end this right here. There will be a part two. So, don't forget to like, subscribe, and as always, stay awesome. Peace.